Hurry! Over here! Come, Come along then, I have something to show you about. By the way, congratulations on making the Quidditch team. Word travels fast round Hogwarts. Welcome to my home, Harry. It's small, but still roomier than your cupboard under the stairs, eh? Now I can show you what I wanted to talk to you about. It's a dragon's egg, Harry. But it's our secret, mind you. The egg is at a very delicate stage. I can't leave it here alone, but I need some fire seeds to give it that last burst of heat to make it hatch. Harry. Can you fetch me some fire seeds? I grow them in caves out in the garden. I need you to collect as many fire seeds as you can find. Careful though, they're spitting fire and the seeds are hot. Let them cool down before you pick them up. Off you go then.
Seed plant. Hagrid told me to stay away from the hot seeds. Plant. Hagrid told me to stay away from the hot seeds.
Great work, Harry. You've collected all the fire seeds I need. Here's a wizard card for you from my own collection. Come on inside, Harry. Wipe your feet now. Them in the fire, Harry. You've done it, Harry. It's hatching. Hey, Eli, I'll call him Morgan. He's a Norwegian ridgeback, you know. Up you come, my beauty. Thanks, Harry. Here, take this flute. It can be used to help some creatures sleep. You'd best get ready for Quidditch now. Should be an exciting game. Slytherin's a tough team, but you'll show them, eh? Hmm, we'd better give Norbert his first feed soon. Here 
History of Hogwarts had won the Quidditch match. Congratulations again for winning the Quidditch match against Slytherin. You are fantastic. Something is troubling me, Harry. Ron and I heard strange noises outside the Forbidden Corridor. Come up to the third floor and have a look. Just read in the Daily Prophet that Gringotts, the Wizard Bank, has been broken into. I wonder who'd do that. You really do have a lightning bolt scar on your forehead. Hello, Harry. Lovely day, don't you think? Please stop, Please, that. stop Please stop Please that. Please stop that. Do I know you? Lovely day, don't you think? Those gnomes are pesky little things, aren't they? Have you met Nearly Headless Lips? He's quite friendly for a ghost. 